such a great exclusive for us to have uh, for the Gold Coast. So oh. the exhibition. Oh, good morning, Gold Coast. You just caught us in the middle of discussing why we're down here <laughs> at the Art Centre Gold Coast. Mm -hmm. Something exciting. Pretty exciting. I should think everybody's going to love to see it. Should we tell them? Maybe we should. Maybe? Maybe. Okay, let's get into the show. I'd heard of tennis elbow, but I'd never heard of surfer's ear until yesterday. Apparently, you get this surfer's ear condition from always being in cold water and wind. You end up with some sort of unusual bone growth on the outside of your ear canal. Sounds really painful. A recent study down in Victoria found that most surfers have it. Now, some local researchers would like to look into it a bit more, into this condition, surfer's ear. So if you'd like to be involved, click the link in this Facebook post to find out how. We've got a street art exhibition coming to the Gold Coast this week. And to find out a little bit more, let's talk to the gallery director. Good, Good morning, morning Gold, Gold Coast. Coast. This is Tracy Cooper Lavery. Now, how are you? I'm great. How are you, Cam? I'm wonderful. What's happening here? Well, it is pretty exciting. We've gone from having possibly one of the biggest shows the gallery's ever done mm. to the next biggest show the oh, gallery's well. ever done. Because the last one was Play School. That's right. This one is Sign of the Times. Mm -hmm. So we're looking at street art from the Gold Coast around Australia and international as well. We've got Banksy, we've got Black Larat, we've got Bambi. Hang on, uh, who's Bambi? Bambi is a British street artist who you know works at night and creates her work and has kept her identity a secret. They think that she's possibly a singer from the UK. I noticed they're also painting the sheds out the side. What's the deal with that? The idea for us was to get the art outside the walls of the gallery and so we've commissioned two artists to create uh, these fabulous works that are going up on the sheds. And now the things that are happening here, it starts on Friday. That's right, so we're, uh, we're doing something different for a change. We're mm -hmm. actually having an official opening that's open to everybody. Oh. So uh, we're hoping we get a really big turn up so mm -hmm. if you'd like to come along starts at six o'clock on Friday and we're going to have uh, drinks and food on the terrace there's going to be a DJ uh, some of the artists are going to be here so it's going to be a really exciting night and Perry Cross is a local guy who became a quadriplegic back in 1994 and since that time he's been on a mission to find a cure for paralysis he's an inspirational bloke and his Perry Cross Spinal Research Foundation is having a gala dinner this Saturday night over at Jupiter's if you want to head along, it sounds very exciting. The ticket price includes canapes, a three-course meal, drinks, an auction, raffle, entertainment. So if you'd like to grab your ticket before they run out, just click on the link in this Facebook post. Now here's Tracy with the weather. Partly cloudy today uh, with a chance of showers and a temperature range day of 21 to 29. Tomorrow is going to be partly cloudy and Friday will be sunny with some light winds. How's that? A <laughs> round of applause. Well done, Tracy. Thank well done. Much. Now step over here. The credits are rolling. Boom. There they are. <laughs> <laughs> That's for all of you guys who liked, shared and commented. Thank you for that. So what else is planned for the day, you reckon? Oh, it's going to be a very busy day. Just finalising mm. all the hang of the exhibition, uh, making a few more contacts with people, ensuring we've got everything ready for Friday night. It's like a timer ticking down, isn't it? It is a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great Wednesday, Gold Coast. Bye.